So I want to share with you what I've been doing to prepare for everything that's coming in the new season. I'll be honest though, the gear set that they made called Aegis doesn't really seem that appealing to me. Granted, I didn't get much time with it in the lab to really experiment like I wanted to, but I do have some more ideas for it. The exotic pistol and gloves are just not my priority either. The only items I care about are the Vindicator exotic rifle, the new Steelworks brand set, along with the new named three round burst rifle with perfectly behind you, system corruption, and instant armor kits, all of which I've made builds for. In this video, I'll give you some awesome methods that you can use right now to get resources needed for almost everything you want day one, and it can all be done today, starting with the Vindicator exotic rifle. And someone made a comment on my video I made for that rifle saying this, and I quote, you know it's unlocked with 350 descent credits. You buy it at the station outside the entrance. The entrance is over here in the corner, if you don't know. And before I can go see for myself if what he was saying was true, phase two of the PTS had ended. Because you know that a lot of features and other things are foreshadowed in the PTS, sometimes by accident. And it just makes sense that the Vindicator will be unlocked through descent and not from the rewards track, like everything always is. This brings me to the first method you should practice right now, which is play descent. Get those credits up just in case they're selling it there when a new season drops. Next thing I've been doing is the golden bullet event. Why? Well, because I want that system corruption. It's looking awesome and there are only a few ways to obtain the gear. Targeted loot in the DZ. Also, when it's not targeted, just that it'll be much more rare. Conflict caches and through the legacy caches that you can purchase through this vendor, with the stars you earn from the golden bullet event now the global event is almost over with and don't worry there will be more opportunities to get stars in future events but i'm on that new season hype train and i want it now i already got three pieces as soon as i opened up my two caches and you can get lucky too get that system corruption because i have an awesome build idea for it that'll actually be perfect for pve pvp and dc farming the last one is easy Start farming countdown and get all the brand pieces that have repair skills and incoming repairs. Because if you want to make builds with this new instant armor kit system, these brand pieces will definitely help you and make them the most efficient to pair well with the Restore Chem Launcher and Hill Hive. And countdown gives you gear and brands like candy, so it shouldn't be hard to get what you need there. And that's what I've been doing to prepare. What have you been doing to get ready for the new season? Please share it below. Also, let me know what you think about what I said here. If it helped you out in any way, then drop a like and subscribe to my channel if you're new here. I'll see you in the next one, fam. Be right out.